afternoon, guys. I don't see any mics, so we just take a show of hands so we can keep some sort of order. We'll come to as many of you as we can. We'll start with James. Hi, Ben. Uh, another brilliant game from Ilkay there. Uh, can you just talk a little bit about his importance to the team and also how on earth he would replace a player like that? Well, you can show again and again and again the, the quality, his importance, and his commitment to all of us, to the club. So. Not just scoring goals, and now he has his momentum because against Leeds was the player today again. So, yeah, he can do everything and everything do it well. He would leave a hole though. Sorry? He would leave a hole if or when he goes? Uh, nobody knows. It's going to happen. Maybe stay, hopefully. Uh, you, you celebrated at the end like you felt you were almost there. You were particularly shaking your fist at the supporters as you were leaving. It feels like this has been a, a huge step towards getting the, the title. Well, when I see Chelsea, Brighton and Bradford, still we have a lot of job to do. So I'm not thinking... Of course, it's, it was Fulham away and today away in between Champions League games. <laughs> it was a tricky one. Especially Everton. I was really impressed the way they handled the game against, against, against Brighton. Um, but since the first minute we controlled the game, except some transitions, if we let them run with uh, Iwobi, Calvin Lewin, McNeil, but especially Dakure, is a dangerous one. We come from more deeper. It's so, so difficult, and every corner and freak, especially corner, they are the best team in the Premier League since Sean Dyke appointment. So it was in, in, in Burley, but he especially is almost a goal every time is, uh, you suffer a lot. Arsenal lose here for a one one corner so I think it happened but we had the patience the momentum and the movements from Riyadh and, and Phil was really good in behind and especially left side in our left side we have more chance to attack because they close most our right and uh, yeah we scored the goals in the right moment and of course it's so important it's nice to celebrate with our fans away because always they are with us here with the travel it's not easy for them and uh, yeah, we need two more games. We need six points to be champion. So three games left. We need two victories. Hopefully, next one at home against Chelsea and we have a match ball in Brighton. You seem to um, have some words with Yerry Mina and Connor Cody at the end. Well, with Cody, is, I know I'm a big fan and big admirer of him. Since Wolves, Yerry Mina is not necessarily what he does. It's not necessary. With, uh, with Harlan? With everyone. So it's a football game. Not necessary to do what he does every single game. So I told him, so you are a good player enough to avoid to do these kind of things. Sam? Uh, I assume you would like the club to do everything they can to keep Gundogan for next season. Sorry? Would you like the club to do everything they can to keep Gundogan for next yeah. season? <coughs> yeah. Have you told them that? I talked many things with the club, yeah. Yeah. And um, Real Madrid and Chelsea. Well, it's a dream come true being here, honestly. I know if at the end we don't get maybe the trophies that people say, ah, oh, they're a, a not good team, a failure team, or it's just a team, but it's a dream come true being here. Only team in Europe to fighting for the whole competitions. We are FA Cup final with uh, United, and the still is not over. The Premier League is never end. We know it for the past with Liverpool. This season is the same. I think pretty sure Arsenal is going to win the two games they have in hand. And um, and been yeah semi final home with our people, second leg to try to reach the final Champions League. So after we come from, for the previous seasons is an extraordinary achievement. What we are doing, hopefully we can finish well. Yes. Hi, uh, just to be clear um, uh, on Mina, what exactly do you mean? If he knows. He like knows. Ask him to him. He knows. And also we could see that uh, Erling and uh, Yari had some uh, interactions during the game. Also we talked about how Erling likes the physical aspect of the Premier League. But how much do you no, think that is not. Uh, that, this is not. A, this is not about the physicality. This is not it's about. about mental or? No, no mental, not either. So there are things that is not necessary to do it, and he does all the time with him, with Jaime, with Jack, with everyone. It's not necessary. Is it crossing the line in terms of the physicality or the rules? Ask, ask him. Invite him to the press conference and ask him. Uh, this is 
Rodri, who seems to pick up enough, and we'll be we'll be we'll be okay on Wednesday. Just on Ilkay, he's your captain this year. How seriously do they take that leadership role and what kind of respect do you think he has uh, from his teammates? He doesn't talk much, but when he talks, everybody listens. And this is the power of the leader. And he shows his leadership in the, every training session, arriving in time, leaving 24 hours his job, <laughs> and, uh, <coughs> and do. And, uh, and play like he's playing. So, it's a guy like uh, close to the box, have an incredible sense of goal. He can do as a holding midfielder defensively without a problem. So, he proved it years ago when Fernandinho was injured and, and he played m a lot of times in that position in games. Like, for example, I remember Burley, like his long balls, like it looks like you need a, a physical holding midfielder. He's not that kind, but he's so intelligent, so clever. And he's a guy that <coughs> he handled the pressure really, really well. His body language is exceptional. He's maybe one of the best players I've ever seen. His body language is for him and for his mates. He's always positive, he's always encouraged, always leading, talking. He played a lot of minutes already. He should need to be rest. Well, he rests against Leeds, I, I guess. But it's important because it's not just playing him his game. He's playing the game for all back four. He's playing the game for the holding midfielder. And that's why it's so important for us. <laughs> so important. Okay. Thank, Thank you, guys. guys. Thank <laughs> you.